Hello mortals, I am Jensen and welcome to the VHS Paradise. This is a spooker that has been on my radar for a long, long time and I'm finally actually getting around to playing the damn thing. Let's fire into it. I am probably a bit too buff to be stereotypically working in... Oh, that's a cool menu. So this actually really does seem very reminiscent of a video store, which I was alive for. However, I was much shorter than our character currently is, so I'm not entirely sure what the perspective from such a such a high angle is supposed to look like. It looks pretty sim- Okay, we've got stamina, that's not good. Probably gonna need to run away at some point from something. What's this? What is this? What is this? Hi Robert, I hope you are well. I hate this damn fever, but I'm recovering. Remember to start your shift by turning on the computer. I've left a good movie for you to watch when you finish your work. By the way, I heard that the rate of thieves increased a lot in the city and much more at night time. Pay attention to what each customer is doing. If you see one leaving without paying, run to stop him. Be very careful. John, do I have some kind of weapon to enforce this, this uh, seemingly voluntary transaction? You'll watch the movie after work. Okay, I guess I will. All right, I'm turning the computer on. I've blown up a microwave. Okay, that's a great start. We have to interact with the tower first. No? Or do they mean this computer here? What is back here? Who knows? I suppose we'll find out later. All right, let's turn this pink computer on. Start the shift. Uh, Y. Y for yes. Oh, this is very accurate. That's Windows 98 to a T. I had one of those. That was my first computer, Windows 98. Hello, sir. Uh, are you going to pay for whatever you're picking? What are you picking out? Busty Babe 6? That's a good one, actually. Uh, I wasn't terribly fond of Busty Babes 128, but the new- No! You stop right there, criminal scum! Yup! Oh, there we go. Dude, I'm unemployed and in debt. I just want to watch a movie in peace. Please. Forgive him and let go? Absolutely not! What do you think this is? A charity? Be kind. Pay for the film. Nice. I was right to harass this man. Wonderful. Okay, what's next? Anything more? The computer's still on. Hello, sir, are you a thief? Jesus, that face! Why do you look like that, lady? Ugh! Hello, boy! Do you have the movie Dune here? Oh yeah, there was actually a Dune before the Dune trilogy came out, by the way. Hello, ma'am, that movie is currently in the cinema. It's not yet in VHS stores. Ah, uh, I don't like the cinema. I'll have to wait then. You're coming here in a couple of weeks, and we may have that movie on sale by then. I understand. Thank you very much. Bye-bye! Uh, did you pocket anything? Did you pocket anything? Is this your car? Is this your car, ma'am? Is it your car? Where are you going? Lady? What the hell is this? Do I have a flashlight? Oh! Uh, hello there, sir. Uh, I was just, uh, admiring, uh, whatever geometry I can make out in this, uh, very, very dim light. What are you looking up? Milf Menagerie 6? Why do you look like an anteater? Oh, I'm gonna get you as soon as you run. Oh, I got it! Don't touch me, asshole. Call the police if you want. I don't care. Uh, yeah, we're gonna call the police on it. Absolutely. We're being paid for this, by the way. We're absolutely being paid for this. Oh, that <laughs> damn chip box. Here, let me hide that real quick. Okay. Hello there, ma'am. Uh, what can I do for you today? Are you going to run away with a video cassette, perhaps? Ooh, Muff Blasters 92. Good choice. Good choice. Oh, that's a first. She's actually coming to pay for it. Yes, ma'am. Hello, I'm taking this movie for one day. It's two dollars, right? Hello? Yes, it was eight bucks when I was uh, uh, quite young. Well, I'm new to the city, you know. It's pretty, but I've heard there's a lot of crime. Yes, be careful. Did you move here or are you on vacation? I'm moving here with my husband. We hope everything goes well. Oh, I understand. Well, I have to go. Good night. Goodbye, good luck and take care. Uh, we didn't get any money, did we? Where's she going? Where do you think she's going? Where's she going? Where's she going? Maybe we are, in fact, the, uh, the stalker, the murderer, the killer. I thought she wasn't wearing a shirt for a second there. Whose car is this? Is this my car? That is a huge car, by the way. What are you doing here? Are you about to rob the place? What is wrong with your face? Milady? Okay, just having a browse. Okay, seeing what's, what's available. Uh, this is an adult entertainment store. I am the uh, owner and proprietor of said location. 
Uh, is there anything that I could perhaps recommend to you uh, for your heated nights? Possibly. Also, why do you look the way you look? I'm not usually one to judge a book by its cover, but this isn't a bookstore, so I'm... Ah, oh, she looks a lot more normal from this angle, but from sideways, not so natural. Hello, I want to rent this movie for three days. Good evening, it's four bucks. There you go, my son will love this gift. Is this a gift for your son? Don't you think you should buy the movie instead of renting it? No, he watches movies repeatedly the first few days and then completely forgets about them. <laughs> He's 11 years old, he loves action movies. Oh, okay then, there's a lot of action in this movie, believe me. Thanks for your purchase. Thanks to you. Goodbye. Okay. Wonderful. Uh, you have a great night, and that movie is not suitable for children. I'm obligated to tell you this. Oh, look at the moon. Oh, that's nice. That's very nice. Oh, hello there, sir. Uh, they all look very Uncanny Valley, don't they? Are you in the mood for a dirty flick? Perhaps? Yes? No? You'll have to pay for it. I'm surprised he heard me with all the hair in his ears. Can we go in here? Ooh. Uh. Uh. Okay. I'll talk to him first. Hello there, sir. How are we? You naughty rabbits in a sexy adventure. Do you... <laughs> do you want to buy or rent it? I want to buy it. Okay, it's 20 bucks. Here is the money. I'm surprised. You're the only cashier who doesn't look at me with disgust or rejection when he sees that I want to buy a movie like that. Well, that's pretty much kind of what we, uh, what we sell in this. I, um... I also really like the movie. The scene's very exciting. That's right! My name is Kyle! What's your name? I'm Robert, apparently. Nice to meet you. Can I ask you a question? Sure. Are you happy in this job? Do you fulfill f f fulfill your dreams here? Why do you ask that? I'm curious. No, the truth is that I'm not happy. It was never in my plans to work in a VHS store. My boss does everything he can to make me have a good time here. But the truth is, that doesn't work. That is uh, kind of sad, actually. That's very, very sad. Not sure if I like that necessarily. It makes me very sad to hear that. Well, it was nice meeting you, Robert. I hope to see you soon. I'm going to go snap one off. Okay. Also, bye. All right. What's down here? 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 What's... Ooh. Ooh, this is nice. A nice dig sound. Oh. Well, my shift is over. Now, let's watch that movie John left. Oh, that's an alarm. Who's there? I'll have you know I have two weeks training in Krav Maga. I am a black belt. Uh, is this my car? Well, at least we can see our surroundings a little bit better. Right. I thought the mechanic could fix the alarm problem, but apparently not. I hope John's movie doesn't disappoint me. I'm still going to have a wee poke around. We're going to see what there is on offer in this uh, hellish location. Can we go in here? No. Can we? No. Righty-ho. There's an armchair here. We're not going to use it. There's a... Oh. One computer on is already enough noise. Can we turn this one off then? No. Okay. Let's have a wee poke around down here. Because I'm pretty sure that... There's got to be secrets, right? There's a door there that we can't access. What's in here? There's a microwave. Which we have broken. We've broken both microwaves. That is uh, absolutely just degenerate of us. But I suppose it's okay. I suppose I suppose if we're if we're just breaking things, it's not that bad. As long as we're not like murdering people and stealing the merchandise, right? That's that's the thing. Why is there so much weird hardware down here? It's like floppy disk. That's a Geiger counter. What the hell is that doing here? That is a literal Geiger counter. Why? Oh my god, this couch really needs a clean. That is disgusting. Uh, can we crouch, maybe? No. No crouch button. Some vents. What's in the safe? Just more DVDs? Okay. All right, let's go watch this thing, I suppose, then. There's a phone there facing the wrong way. I bet that was a conscious decision as well. A phone there, two computer monitors. Okay, let's go up to... Oh my god, that actually scared me. I was not expecting there to be noise on that door. Okay. We'll grab this. Close the shop and watch the movie. Yes! Let's do that. Let's do that right this second, huh? What a mediocre movie. I've never seen such a predictable ending. I wonder what jo John saw in this to recommend it to me. I better go home. I'm tired of being here. 
Oh my god! What in the gods? Name is that thing? Is that a cat? Is that wearing a cat mask? What the hell is going on? Oh my god, that is terrifying! Ah! Where am I? Naughty rabbits in a sexy adventure. <sighs> oh, oh my God. Okay. One of three endings. There's more than one ending. Nice. I'm going to find them all. That was good. That was a short but good horror experience, I believe. Wonderful. Okay. Next run, we are going to try and escape this wanker. Avoid that. I think this guy's a thief, right? This lady here is a thief. She's going to uh, try and bugger us by picking up the uh, the first smutty movie she can find and uh, taking off with it. I knew it! Please, it's my son's birthday. He's seven years old and wants to have this adult movie very much, but I have no money. Have mercy. No mercy! No mercy! No mercy! No mercy! Woo woo! No mercy alarm! Woo woo! It's going off! Woo woo! Woo woo woo! He's in a... Big suit, this dirty old man. Is he gonna try to take off with it? Let's see, salad fingers, are you going to? No, he's actually gonna try and pay for it. That's creepy. Hello there, sir. Good night, sir, I'm taking this film for one day. Here's the two dollars. After a bad day, there is nothing better than spending the night watching a good movie at home. What happened? I was fired due to downsizing. I worked in an office. I'm sorry to hear that. Did you like that job? No, my boss was an idiot. The good thing about all this is that while I look for another job, I will have time to meditate and for myself. I understand. Luckily, my boss is a good person. He tries to encourage me to be happy with this job, but he, he still doesn't succeed. Very often, I have to deal with this very strange people and also thieves. It's horrible, but unfortunately, I have to continue with this job because I have to pay for my studies. Yes, lately this city is very insecure. There is a lot of crime and many crazy people on the loose. You have to take care of yourself. Well, I hope that soon the work situation will improve for both of us. You just have to be optimistic. Goodbye. Thank you very much. Have a nice night. Enjoy snapping it off. He just bought a copy of Snatch Patrol 69. Hello there. You have a strange shirt. Wow, he actually looks kind of put together. I bet he's a thief. I bet he's a... I bet he's a dirty ruffian. We're going to have to arrest him, I think. Boom, 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 boom. Prison will be your tomb. Yep. Please, dude, I really want to see this movie, but my parents don't want to lend me money. Hello there, sir. Uh, Alec Baldwin, it seems, I presume. Uh, here to uh, snap one off after accidentally committing manslaughter, are we? Is, is that what I'm getting from this exchange right here? Okay. I feel like he's about to manslaughter me. All right, he's, he's picked a smutty movie. Hello, friends. I want to buy this movie. It's $20. Excellent. Finally. Finally what? I have finally reached 100 movies purchased. I love collecting these wonders. Do you even watch the movies? No, I don't see them. I just buy them to decorate my house. Okay, are you going to pay or... Ah, yes. Take it. Thank you very much. He's weird. We need to keep an eye on this guy. Is this the dirty old man? Yep, this is the guy that murdered us last time, right? Or at least kidnapped us. There's a couple of doors that we should be able to access, right? I have no idea how to access them, but there's got to be a way. Probably like a, a key or something somewhere. Oh, well. Hello there, sir. How are we? I think this time we should just tell him to piss off. I have to close the shop now. Goodbye. That was weird and creepy. But now we're supposed to go and watch the film. Right, and then he will be behind us. Good. Let's... Oh, I have to turn off the car alarm first. So he hits our car right on his way up. There we go. Let's fix that. Now we know exactly what he's doing to us, don't we? We know exactly what he's doing to us. What did he... Did he, like, put something in? No. I think he only took something. Game of the year! Close the shop and watch the movie. Yes! All right. It was a crap movie. It was a crap movie. Mediocre at best. We know this. We know that it was a crap movie. Hello? Okay, I'm gonna rope a dope him around the couch right there. I'm gonna sprint up the staircase. And we are then going to continue onwards. He's right behind us, by the way. 
In the car. In the car. Go. Second ending. Second ending. Is he in the back seat? Is there someone in the back seat? I bet there's someone in the back seat, right? There's got to be. What? The brakes don't work. Oh. Two and three. You died in a traffic accident. Okay. There's also this door here, which also does not have any way of opening it from the outside. Is there like... All right, done that. Let's pop that. So can't get in there either. Let's hit our shift then. Let's take a fat toke off of work. Let's let's smoke a, a bong of work ethic. Hello there, sir. I'm going to catch you, but release you. Uh, is your neck okay? Wait, where are you going? Oh, he's fine. He's just deciding. Sir? How are we today? Nice um chin stubble you've got there. Is he a thief? We're about to Yes. This movie is for my little niece, please. Uh sure. You can You can you... wait, no. I've been forgiving them and letting them go this whole time. No. No forgiveness. Jail. Jail to you. Okay, that's one. I've been hitting Y this whole time. I just figured that that was like, yes, let's uh, arrest him. Hello there, Mr. Thief. I recognize that you are probably here to steal something. Correct? Possibly? Potentially? I bet you are. All right, what are you going to try to steal? My heart. Okay. That's a new bold strategy. I've never seen that one before. Okay. Bumping into me. but Having a wee bump and a grind. That's fine, I suppose. Right, he ho. He's he's decided, he's leaning down, he's decided on Busty Brunette's 99. Awesome. Uh let's not forgive him. Off to jail. Jail. Off to jail. This is uh the good old porno man. I'm sorry, but I'm not allowed to chat with customers. You enjoy your movie. Bye bye. Okay, he's gonna hit the car, right? He's gonna hit the car. He's gonna hit the car. He's gonna hit the car. Wait, what? My shift is over. Let's watch the movie that John left me. Okay, we watched him leave. Oh, maybe the alarm goes off when we hit the, um... What's my doodle? Here, right? Boop! Okay, let's watch the film. The alarm didn't go off. Huh. Strange. Okay. All right, we're gonna run to the nearest door. What the hell? Oh, so one of the thieves was actually scouting the place. Right, so it wasn't him with the, with the, with the. Wait, was that me? Oh, it was me. <laughs> that jump scared me. That actually scared the piss out of me. I don't think there's anything else, is there? Can we go in here yet? No. He's not going to be waiting outside, is he? I'm pretty sure we had him arrested. Okay. Looking pretty good so far. Do we just... Do we just go home? Hello? He's not in the back seat, is he? Please don't tell me the brakes are out. We're fine. Okay, let's chase this bus. Let's let's drive so far up its ass. Uh, we should have bought it dinner first. You arrived home safely. Feels anticlimactic. We have had all three endings so far. We've had all three endings. But I feel like there's more, because there's those two locked doors that we never really get to go in. Surely there's... Wait, why is it a different colour? The, the text is yellow. It was purple, wasn't it? I'm not crazy on this. I feel... Oh! Ah, ah, jump scared by a door again. Can we go in here? No. Uh, let's break this. Okay, good. Is there something downstairs, maybe? Okay. 
This is suspicious. Oh, no way. I found the key. I found a key. There is a secret ending. I don't think it's to here though. Maybe it's the one upstairs. What's in here? Oh. Defense. Oh, okay. Okay. Nice. Uh, insert Final Fantasy trumpet fanfare. The predator has become the predator. The prey, the prey has, the prey has become the, okay, let's use the knife. I think we need to actually confirm the kill on just the serial killer, right? All right, let's have a talk with her. Piss off, piss off and enjoy your adult smut. Lady, she's off to watch some porn. I have to watch a little bit of pornography. Pornography. All right, who's next? I'm gonna stand in the window like a mannequin. Boom! <laughs> Just cause a heart attack in this door for fun because I'm bored. Let's, let's hide. Let's hide over here. Because I'm pretty sure this is the guy, right? This is him. And we want to try and murder him. How the hell did you find me so fast? What the hell? No, my car! Okay, that means that we have definitely got the right ending. I can't wait to see what happens, right? I can't wait to see whether or not we are the murderers or, uh, or something like that. All right, let's watch this mediocre movie. Knowing that we are going to engage in a little bit of tasteful bloodlust very shortly after it finishes. What a mediocre movie. Hello? Yes, yes, yes. Ah! Oh! What? Naughty Rabbits in a sexy adventure. Oh my god, I think I know how to... I think I know how to figure out who it is. Is she gonna sprint away? Let's see. Okay, so the girl, the girl bought something from right here. We have to remember that. When this guy at the end comes in, he is going to buy the, the movie, right? So we need to remember where all of these customers are getting their film from. And then when he picks his DVD up, we know exactly what that DVD is. It's also, the DVD that we, uh, sorry, the cassette that we see at the end of the game, right? At the end of the sequence? Okay. This guy's a thief. Quite clearly. Yep. Uh, sure, we'll, we'll forgive him and let him go. But, we will remember where he got that tape from. Okay, the nice looking lady got it from over there. Um, burnt neck guy got it from here. Looks like he's getting his film from the same place as the thief. Like the exact same place. If it is from this area here, if the end guy gets his DVD, his cassette from this area here, then it could be either this guy who just got laid off from work, or it could be that uh, burnt neck guy. Burnt neck man, suit guy, from here. Nice lady, from here. Right, he's getting it from here, which is the same place as the nice lady, but slightly further over. So I think in this run, we're not only going to murder the murderer, but we're also going to find exactly who the murderer is. Okay. This is the old lady. She doesn't get anything, which actually reduces the amount of people we have to remember by one. Goodbye, old lady. She didn't snatch anything on her way out, does she? So this should be, be the smut guy, right? All right, let's see where he actually gets the DVD from. Not here. It's not going to be here. Okay, he is the murderer because that is the only... He's the only person that's got something from this entire aisle. He has to be the murderer. Right, okay, so it's it's just... Yes, 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 yes. I did it! I stabbed him! All over the TV screen as well. Hey! Heroic ending, you finished the serial killer once and for all. And we know exactly who he is now. He's the, he's the dirty old man. Long story short, we know exactly who the murderer is. It's the obvious guy because he was the only guy that picked out a, a film from that aisle that he picked his film from. And we murdered him, which is best case scenario. So... 
Thank you so much for watching. Right up here, you're going to find the playlist for one and done spookers that I have made. And right up here, you're going to find another playlist that I think you'd really enjoy. And down in the description of this video, you'll find a link to my Discord, where you can come and chat to me and my community personally. And until I make the next one of these videos, thank you so much for watching, and goodbye!